you guys, it's your girl T. And when I tell you, honey, Twitter has been left in shambles this morning, okay? Uh, no, I cannot afford to take the top off of Maybach, but possibly a damn Hyundai Beyonce, okay? I took the top off the Hyundai, ay, cause I can't afford a damn Maybach, ay. I took the top off the Hyundai, what? Cause I can't afford a damn Maybach, ay. <laughs> Now that's the remix, okay? How you doing? Honey, Biggie was like, bitch, if you're gonna be down with bad boys, a record label, a staff member, and part of the crew, you gotta eat the booty like grocery. Make them do it. I might let your boy show for me, but you gotta eat the booty like groceries. Hey, hey. Um, I love J Lo. I don't like DJ Khaled ever since he said he won't eat the box. I can't fuck with DJ Khaled, but J Lo did a good job, okay? Now, with that being said, Kevin Hart is still a damn cheater, and I will still call his wife make real. Okay. All right, so you guys know what that means. When you guys see that meme, we have another Pissy Pied Piper story, okay? Matter of fact, let me go ahead and play this small flashback, okay? Go ahead and check this out, and I'm gonna come back with the rest of my commentary. I was just in shock. I, like, my eyes and my mouth kept getting wider and wider as the song went on. Like, I started off just, you know, sipping slow, like, Honey. When I tell you my damn wig was snatched off my damn head, okay? Oh! Oh! My edges were gone by the time I got done listening to Pusher T's Drake diss, okay? I'm gonna need you to stop this hobo penis tour, okay? You're starting to look like Miss Monique, okay? Hey, my loves, I need you guys to boycott my penis. <laughs> no. Candy and every man wants a woman. You know what I'm saying? You know, Tiny is Candy's homegirl, honey. And when they kept saying, every man wants a woman. I'm just saying, okay? <laughs> I can't even sip my tea. Do y'all believe this shit? Vibes Cartel, if you don't sit down and do your damn 35 years in prison, you damn killer. All righty then, okay? And yes, it is coming from our first favorite state, Wretched Ass Florida, okay? So that's what Tiffany Haddish had to say, okay? And like the old saying goes, chicks who can't throw hands, they throw drinks, and hoes who can't fight, they damn bite, okay? So with that being said, Tiffany Haddish, if you're gonna tell it, then you gotta tell it all, or else have a tall glass to shut the fuck up. Okay, am I the only one tired of Tiffany Haddish constantly using Beyonce's name for a damn online storyline? And I was telling Chloe to be careful because the same way you get them is how you lose them, and if he can cheat with you, he can damn sure cheat on you, okay? You know, Emily B is not the first one to go back to her abusers, okay? It's just that she's in the public eye, she's a public figure, so people want to go ahead and drag her. But how many of your own homegirls been slapped, punched, and abused, cheated on by their baby's father or boyfriend, and then a week later they're back together? And then at that point, you told yourself, you know what? I'm not involving myself no more because every time I get involved and try and have her back, she runs back to her abuser. This is the same situation. So I'm not shocked at all that Emily B is back with Fabulous because so many regular Schmegler women do this. Was making it rain on these damn hoes, okay? But the crazy thing is that Lucci was in these videos. Not only was he touching these women, he was also putting dollars in their damn Woohoo! He took the power away, so that way it hurts us less. And, and I don't believe that. I just feel like, you know, that was just some bullshit that NWA put out. You know, it, it didn't hurt us less. If anything, it desensitized it. You know what I'm saying? It made it desensitizing to other black people because, again, it's a lot easier to kill a nigga, but it's very hard to kill a brother. Nobody says I'm about to go out here and go ride on these brothers. I'm about to go shoot these brothers. I'm about to go, you know what I'm saying, jump these queens. But you will say you're about to go ride on these niggas. You, I'm about to go kill these niggas. That sounds a lot better than saying brother. So no, you didn't take the sting out of it at all. It's Tyler Perry, all right? Because rumor has it, his ass is in the damn lab with a pen and a pad writing Medea goes to Wakanda. He's the only person I damn know that works out every damn day and don't lose a damn pound. How does that work, DJ Khaled? You can do it. You can do it. All that talk you talk, let's do it. Yeah, shut the fuck up. You're trying to shame her because you had to suck a bunch of dick and you had to walk the whole straw? I'm confused. How is that Black China's fault? And hit a tree because a crackhead was in the... <laughs>
<laughs> okay, let me gather myself. I'm sorry. Girl, if you don't sit your ass down with that stupid ass story. I've lost a lot of respect for Drake, and especially being that he's admitted that he's only seen the child one time. One time, one time. Not only does Fetty Wap have a damn wandering eye, he also has a damn wandering dick too, okay? That damn herpes popped up on her like, surprise, bitch. We in this together. I don't give a damn what y'all got to say about the queen, okay? She did the damn thing. She put on her black girl magic. You know what I'm saying? She represented beautifully. Beyonce is one thing. It's a good day to have a good day. It's a good day to have a good day. Five Cartel, sir, I'ma need you to have a tall glass to shut the fuck up. Worry about your bleached skin and your purple lips before you worry about, you know what I'm saying, what the hell's on top of my head and other black women's heads, okay? Thank you. We'll see you in 35 years, sir, okay? All right, bye-bye now.